Hey everybody, Scott Spritzer here, DocSports.com. Welcome to the update for Wednesday, July 3rd, 2019. I got a free pick coming up in just a moment. First, a quick note, if you have yet to become a member over at DocSports.com, it's a real cool way to give it a trial run. Nothing to wait for. You click on the link below the video, get yourself set up for a free $60 account. Use those free 60 bucks on any of my daily packages or any other capper over at DocSports.com. It's as simple as that. And again, the free $60 account, the trial run at DocSports.com all begins by clicking on the link below the video. All right, well, last night here for the free pick, unfortunately, our game was postponed. We had that total between uh, the Tigers and the White Sox, different pitchers and the doubleheader uh, for Wednesday, and we're not on either one of those games between the Tigers and the White Sox, but a no play here last night. As far as everything else over at uh, DocSports.com and the premium picks, we went down to defeat with the Cubbies in baseball. We won again in the WNBA. Easy winner with Minnesota. We're now on a 75% run nine and three in the WNBA with their last 12. And we're now hitting 61% on the season in the WNBA. We've got a couple of things going on for Wednesday at DocSports.com. Big five unit knockout in Wednesday's WNBA action. And we've got Major League Baseball, not one but two plays. The top play happens to be our next midweek mismatch. 116 and 75 is our current run going way back with these plays. We've hit the last couple of weeks with our midweek mismatch match plays and again that's the top play for us on Wednesday in baseball again a 2 and 0 report in baseball including that midweek mismatch we look to go to 117 and 75 with our midweek mismatch run and uh, those will be available at 11:30 a.m. Eastern 8:30 a.m. Pacific same time for the WNBA as we look to extend the run in the Women's Pro Basketball League to 10 and 3 with our last 13. Couple of other notes PGA. We've got uh, this week's 3M Open and uh, the picks that we have, two matchups, will be posted at 11 30 a.m. Eastern Time, 8 30 a.m. Pacific on Wednesday at docsports.com. Gives you plenty of time uh, to get set for Thursday's uh, first round. So be sure to go grab that over at docsports.com. A pair of four unit plays, matches in this week's PGA. Everything else, always the same. The night before NASCAR is when we post our picks for NASCAR. We're on this humongous run. Uh, upwards of almost 80% winners with our matchups going all the way back to May 1st. Won again last week. And uh, we had Harvick over Kyle Busch. And here's the thing, man. We'll have this week's picks in NASCAR. It's a Saturday race in the Monster Series. And we'll have our picks posted by Friday night no later than 11 p.m. Pacific time. As far as this week's uh, CF fell as always with football we post on thursday 6 p.m eastern 3 p.m pacific we're 100 percent in the cfl through the first three weeks those wagering just 100 dollars per unit already up two thousand dollars and i've got a big seven unit main event going this week it'll be posted again on thursday and that'll be at 6 p.m eastern time so don't miss out on all of that and again it all begins on wednesday two baseball plays top play is the midweek mismatch and we'd like to go to 10 and 3 on our current wnba run let's get to our free pick today don't forget those NFL reports are coming out during the All-Star break. Uh, let's get to the free pick, though, today. And we're going to back the Houston Astros right now, about a buck thirty favorite on the road over Colorado. Wade Miley going for the Strohs. And for the Rockies, it is the struggling Peter Lambert. Here's the thing about Lambert. He had two nice starts to start the season, both against the Chicago Cubs. But since then, he has been an absolute and utter mess, giving up a ton of earned runs, like 25 hits in his last, oh, what is it, 12, 13, 14 innings, not doing well there. I think it's 16 innings now and 25 hits. And then you've got all these home runs that he's given up right now. I mean, if you look what Lambert's done exactly uh, since the opening two games against the Cubs, it's 16 earned runs, 25 hits, six home runs, three starts. That's a grand total of 12.2 innings pitched. I wanted to make sure I got that exactly right. Put on the cheaters to make sure and that's what Lambert has done. I think Houston gets to him. Listen, as far as Wade Miley, he's not hes not really, you know, you can't say that he's been any great shakes of late and we do want him to keep his walks down. But even if he's a tad off, even if he's not completely on his A game, I think Houston's going to get to Lambert in Colorado quite a bit in this particular contest and going to be able to win their fifth straight game. They've won four in a row. They scored nine runs last night. They've scored 20 run, 21 runs in their last three games. There was a time where Houston was having a rough time scoring runs for you know, a little stretch there not too long ago. They're back on track. Again, four-game win streak, 21 runs last three games, and I expect another big night on a Wednesday. So we're going to back the Houston Astros over Colorado. And by the way, Houston's done well here at Coors Field. You can go check out the record. 
record six and one in their last seven in Denver. So the Houston Astros minus a buck 30 as we speak over Colorado, your Wednesday free pick. And again, don't forget about Wednesday's plays, 2-0 in baseball, including that Major League Baseball midweek mismatch. We'll look to go to 117 and 75 in those. And as far as basketball, the WNBA will look to extend the run to 10 and three. All three plays available at 1130 a.m. Eastern Time, DocSports.com. All right, that's going to do it for us for Wednesday. Let's put it in the win column. And if you like these videos, be sure to click on that thumbs up button. Be sure to subscribe. I'm Scott Sprites for DocSports.com. We're right back here Thursday, July 4th, no later than 5 a.m. Eastern, 2 a.m. Pacific. We'll talk to you then.